Hello, Panthers. Next lesson is on finding the mean of data. Now, when I'm looking at the mean, and we're going to look at median and mode later, but I'm trying to find the measures of central tendency. Central being middle and 10 meaning tends to be or likely to be. So I'm looking for ways to find the middle of a wide range of data. I want to kind of find what is the middle. Now you've heard the word average quite a bit. The math word, and you know, mathematicians always like to have their fancy words for things, but the math word is mean. So we think average, but to find this, we add all the values, and then we divide by the number of values that we added. Now, if you remember when we were doing the homework completion competition on the backboard, I was adding all of your percentages together to find who the winner was going to be for the most completed homework. That was finding the average. I would add up all of the percentages and then divide by the 10 numbers that I added. Let me show you how this works. Now, last year, when I actually got to have a class, we were talking about how many siblings fourth hour had last year. So we went around and I asked every student, how many siblings do you have? And they said, in the house, out of the house. I said, just plain siblings, half brothers, step brothers, sisters, whatever. So here's what we have. Three, five, one, one, five, two, one, seven, five, and on and on, as you can see. So my, my way of finding the mean is by adding all of those numbers together. So I added three plus five plus one plus one all the way through. And I found that we had 63 siblings in fourth hour. Well, when I counted how many kids are in that class, it was 19. So I added them all up and I divided by the number of values that I added, the number of responses that I got up here. And I found out that it, the answer was 3.3. Well, we're not gonna talk about a point third of a person because that's kind of gross. So we're just gonna go with three because it's closer to three than it is to four when we're rounding. So the average or the mean for the number of siblings in fourth hour last year was three. Stay tuned for more.